So I want to put a picture on a button. So let's make our, our window and our button first. From T Kinter, import star. And then from T Kinter, I want to import TTK. And then I'm going to make the root window. That's going to be equal to capital TK, open close parens. And then I'm going to make button number one. That's going to be equal to TTK. Uh, Mr. TTK, tell your button function to put the button into the root window. And the text on it is going to say uh, something simple like click. That's all. Now the next thing is uh, B1, pack your silly self right onto that root window. And he does it. Ah, where is he? There he is. Whoops. So, he just put himself onto this window. All well and good. Now, the next thing that I want to do is, you see that button? I'd like to put a picture on that button. And I know just the picture I, I'm going to use. Me. <laughs> I put an icon on there. I'll use my picture and then I'll show you how we can modify it. Make it look good. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a, uh, a variable called my image. MI. That's going to be equal to the following. I want to call the photo image guy photo image method mr photo image yes i'd like you to get a file for me and that file is in the uh, e drive and it's in the logarithms uh folder <clears throat> oh i really screwed that up <coughs> there we go <coughs> oh boy i'm dying and uh, it's an E drive and logarithms folder. And the name of the file is george.gif. Close quotes, close parens, and I hit enter. So now I took the, uh, I told the system, told the photo image, to grab this file. And assign it to MI. All right, that's good. Now what do I do? Uh, button number one. Yes, I want to want you to configure silly self in the following manner. Oh, okay, tell me what you want me to do. I want you to use as an image whatever has been assigned to MI. All right, he says, I'll do it. Oh, and uh, put him on the right-hand side of that button. Compound equals right. So the picture is going to be on the right side of the button. And there it is. Now, let's see what that looks like. Oh, no. It's Mr. Giant size here. Wow. That is super too big. What a handsome looking guy that is. But that picture is way too big. Way too big. And make it big, big. You'll see the pictures on the right hand side of the button. There's the button that says click on it. Oh, it's terrible. What are we going to do? I know what we'll do. We can miniaturize this picture. And, yeah, that's all we'll do. Let's move him out of the way for a sec, for the moment. Now, uh, we're going to make a, a tiny... See, this guy is, is my image. I'm going to make a tiny my image. Tiny my image. A teensy my image. And it's going to be equal to the following. Uh, take my image, and I want you to subsample that image. There's, there it is, subsample right there. Whoa, 
Well, hit the enter key. That really screwed up. One more time. Um, I'm going to take my tiny, tiny my image. I'm going to make that equal to my image dot sub sample. And what am I going to sub sample? I'm going to tell the system to um, take every sixth x direction pixel and every sixth y direction pixel and use that, construct an image out of that, and assign that to this guy. Wow. You can do that. Yep. You can do that. I hit enter. Oh, no problemo so far. Now, still look at the picture. He's still there. Still too big. But watch what happens in a moment. Now, I'm going to tell the system the following. P1, I want you to configure yourself again. But this time, I want you to use as your image. I want that to be equal to TMI. Close parens. Now, stand back with bated breath as I hit the enter key. And watch what happens to this guy. Now, I switch over to this window and click. He may go into the background. No, he just did. Okay, hit enter. And let's get him back up there. Oh, wow. Look at that. That is awesome. That button just... <laughs> that's, that's wild. There it is. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Now the button doesn't do anything because I didn't connect it to a uh, config. I didn't configure it to uh, be connected to any uh, function. But we'll do that. Uh, we did that last time, but we can do that again next time. Very good. I like that. Looks very good. That's the kind of picture you would see on a button. Small. Fairly clear. Okay. That's all I want to talk about for now. This is George Bull. Thank you so much for listening. And if you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you'd go and click on that like button just a little bit below. And uh, I'd appreciate that. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.